our anchor winch is uh, pretty big. Um, That's an impressive. And so uh, it's got two anchors. We have an anchor on either, either side. The anchors weigh about 600 pounds. And then this chain, which is 90 feet of chain here, is another 1,000 pounds. So we're usually pretty solid on the bottom when we, when we drop it. Uh, we also have a second anchor on the starboard side, which is all chain. Uh, we don't use that much because, as Nancy mentioned, somebody has to flake it, and that somebody is usually me. And it's, it's, it's a nasty work. So th this was originally 110 DC uh, when the boat was built, and it was replaced uh, with hydraulics in the, during the overhauls in the 70s. So it's all hydraulic now. And how much chain on this side? Uh, that's about 300 feet, I think. Three or 400. Three or four and then feet. on that side, there's 100 feet, but then there's cable, there's about 400 feet, 300 feet 300 of cable, feet, something yeah. like that. And the draft of the boat is? The draft is about eight feet. eight feet, yeah. It's probably a little less than when it was originally built because the original engines were much heavier than the Caterpillars that we have now. So, yeah, it's about eight feet. Yeah. The winch was built in, in Seattle by a company called Markey, and they're still around. So when we bought the boat, we, were, we saw the little plaque here saying Marky, Seattle, Washington, and uh, I emailed them and said, you know, do you know, do you know anything about this, uh, this winch? And they sent me a PDF of the original plans. And then a couple of years ago, we actually took the winch off and gave it to them and they rebuilt it for us. So it's all back to specs. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. Should we go up on the upper deck? So then on the upper deck, we have the, the pilot house roof, which is a nice area to sit. Yeah, nice. this is... This is the place Enjoy to be on a day like today, that's oh, for yeah. sure. Yeah. Excellent, yeah. Some of the electronics, this is a, a new Furuno a GPS compass, and it has, it has four different GPS units in it, so it's incredibly precise, which is, it's, just, it's great.